so early. Let me catch my breath. Nothing like the sweet menthol fumes of Solomon cigarettes. Today, boys and girls, we're going to explore the magic and mystery of the human immune system. Excluding those dirty reds. <laughs> the immune system is what keeps your body healthy and alive from millions of bacteria and viruses that would love to feast on your flesh. But to best understand the monumental power of the immune system, it's important that we look at it when it is in danger. So, we've got young Harold here to help us out. will be our test subject. What? Uh, I mean, uh, our hopping cool cat. Now freeze, cool cat! Your immune system has many parts that work together to keep you healthy, including lymphatic vessels, lymph nodes, your thymus, your spleen, your priors patches, your appendix, bone marrow, tonsils, and adenoids. In addition, you have macrophages that help fight off viruses and bacteria. Now that we've seen what a strong, healthy immune system looks like, we should look at what happens when it's attacked by damned communists. I... I mean viruses. Viruses and bacteria can enter the body through a variety of ways such as um, breathing in, ingesting, or well, even a simple paper cut. Ouch! Ow. Oh geez, Harold. Are you okay? Hello? Larry, Brain here. We've got a breach in Sector 6. What happened? Paper cut. Viruses and bacteria have broken into the body. How much time do I have? Not much. You'll have to travel through the blood vessels to get there fast. And for God's sake, be careful, Larry. I will. For freedom within the united cells of Harold. I'll have the team meet you at the site. Godspeed, Larry. Alright boys, it's time we show these pathogens who the real head honchos are around here. Let's send them back to where they came from. My family and I came to this cell 15 years ago, escaping poverty, depression, and public works programs. We pulled ourselves up by our bootstraps and overcame impossible odds. We believed in the dream that one day, all macrophages could live in peace and homeostasis within young Harold to raise families and prosper in ways my ancestors never could have imagined. I'm not about to let these damn reds take our freedom. ATTACK!
We took vitamins. Wow! Wasn't that the cat's meow? <laughs> No thanks, mister. Seriously, Aaron. No. I'm good, thank you. Alright, If it wasn't for Harold's immune system, he'd probably be dead by now. We've still got the endocrine and reproductive systems to take care of. <laughs> Tune in next week, kids. <laughs>